The language of one of the New Guinea tribes contains Russian words. For this, we should thank Russian anthropologist Nicholas Mikluhu Maklai. His mentor, founder of ecology Hekel, taught that living organisms should be studied in their natural habitat. Risking his life, Nicholas alone walked around the shores of the Red Sea. He studied animals, but the main mystery for him was human being. And so he went to New Guinea. Aboriginal people were cautious of Europeans, but Mikluhu Maklai won their trust through modesty and patience. He cured one of them and was able to make friends with the tribe. Mikluhu Maklai fought against the oppression of these Aboriginal people. He dreamed of an independent Papuan Union under the protection of Russia. During the expeditions, he proved that there are no inferior or superior races. Peculiarities of peoples are the product of their natural and social environment and are not determined at birth. Leo Tolstoy wrote to the traveler, You have proven that a human remains a human everywhere. Mikluhu Maklai's birthday became a professional holiday for ethnographers.